Got him. Let's yeah. Go. Sixty-nine point two four. Ooh. Wow. I'm the devil's Let's advocate. Go. Look there, I got a full I'm one percent on the advocate. pure champion. Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Darth Sloan here, your partnered content creator for Expansive Worlds. Looks like we got a big guy right there. I'm out here today showing you guys how to catch a diamond common carp. Now, of course, that part of it is RNG. It's a big guy here, though, looks like. But I'm going to be going over my gear, my technique, which I can show you right now, too. Um, we are already... At 70% drag and I want you to pay attention to this part right here I like to set my drag to where I can pump a little bit okay be ready to hit the Z button when it goes up to cherry red if it goes all the way it can snap instantly so you got to watch that but what I like to do is I like to set my drag to where it's in the pink but I can do little small pumps you didn't get to really demonstrate that during this fight because I caught the fish so close to the boat. But you will get to see that in the footage that I'm going to drop in of me catching my 69-pound diamond cart that you just saw. That was my first cart, and that was a dandy to catch. First diamond cart. That was a dandy to catch, you know, for your first one. And I'm just using the devil's advocate and the pure champion reel. So I'm, I'm not level 90 yet. I, I hear that it gets a lot easier when you get the level 90 reel and the level 100 match rod, because then you can use a 55 pound braided line on these big guys. But I was kind of hoping, you know, that I would land a smaller diamond to be able to get it in. But we managed to wrestle in the 69 pound common carp. So I just want to show you all some places and some techniques that I use. Again, little short pumps. Thank you, Amy the Huntress, for sharing that with me. Um, plus, it's dangerous to do long pumps because at any time that fish could turn and just snap your line instantly. So just as a rule of thumb with these common carp, I just do those little quick little pumps. And what I like to do is I like to let that, I like to let it go pink up around nine o'clock and then just bump it up into cherry red. Just keep bumping it up into cherry red. When you're in a longer fight, you can do that. When you catch them real close to the boat, it's kind of sporadic. But that's what I like to do. It's great XP out here fishing for these common carp. I'm now going to target mirror carp because it's pretty good XP too. And I don't have a diamond mirror carp yet. But I just want to show you guys where we're at. I like this little spot. From what we're learning from the community, these deep green pools of water these really dark areas is where they like to hang out a friend of mine demonic biscuit likes to search the changes in depth like he'll he'll cast up and down these lines these depth changes and uh you know that's that's kind of what he does um so that's something you can do too i think i caught mine kind of like right in the middle i didn't catch mine here i caught mine down here uh, actually, no, I did. Uh, now that I remember, I, I cast out this way, so I was in a depth change. So there could be something to that, actually. But here's where I caught mine uh, yesterday. During, right, the last fish I caught at the stream on Twitch, I caught it right there, 69 pounder. His fin's actually sticking up to the water. You'll get to see that footage here shortly. But before I drop that in there, guys, please do me a favor. Hit that like, subscribe, notify bell channel is growing and with your help it can grow even faster and who knows we may end up splitting our time doing more streams over on youtube it is tuesday so tonight we will be doing the tackle tuesday stream where i am currently in first place for the season we're going into week eight tonight we're going to do camiso barbel so i'm excited about that just a little free piece of advice here real quick i know this isn't a camiso barbel stream but right there hmm Travel there to that trailhead and just anywhere in that area right there is delish for Camiso Barbel. Number one hot dog. You'll thank me later. Okay, so let's hop into it. I'll drop the footage. Yeah, and Kyle. Oh my goodness. It's fin sticking out of the water. Oh. 
Whoa, that looks big. It just popped up on screen for me. Oh, he's running. Oh. Honey, I might be a few minutes late. Yeah, right? <laughs> Got something to finish up here. Oh, my goodness. Gone. Yeah, he's just going. This might be the one, if I can land him. Oh, he ain't even slowing down. Nope. <laughs> He'll slow down about 230 to 250 if you're lucky. <laughs> I'm bumping it up to 70%. I'm trying to bump it into that cherry red and wear him out. Yep. Oh, that was angry. <laughs> oh, he's going, man. Oh, he he going. <laughs> How much room have I got on this 38 braided? Three something? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're into three. Yeah, I think 327. you got 300. Something like, I know it's at least 300. This might be the I one, have... guys. Oh, this might be it. He's Ooh. going. He's still going. He's mad. Yeah, easy. It. Yep. He's like, I was he checking this chick runs. out over here. Now I got a sharp object in my mouth. Yeah, I was just trying to eat. <laughs> Hey, I got another gold. Wow, this is crazy spot. Well, when I saw his fin sticking out of the water, I was like, I've not seen that before. I say, as it swam over, it came up for your bait. Yeah, it's sticking up a little bit. Sorry, chat, if I'm not paying attention to you right now, I have to be like really focused. Like my finger is on the Z button. I got to get a little aggressive so it don't spool me. There you go. I'm not even going to cast out. I want to watch this develop. Oop. Oh. Oop. Hey, just. See, you got, yeah, you got to uh, They turn and. Ooh. I had to back off a little. I took it yep, down 65. Yep. Oh, like he don't just go a little. He it goes up a lot all of a sudden. It goes. <laughs> yeah, it's like zero to, to red instantly when they when they turn. Let me take a look at this reel. It's 246 at 0 0.022, but the braid is thinner, so you probably have 320-ish. Yeah, the braid is 0 0.011, so half the diameter probably gets you another hundred, at least another hundred feet. Yeah. 246 on that reel. What? That's I got with braided point line. Zero two two. The braid is. Yeah, that's half the diameter. So Thank you so much, Soprano. Hundred feet. Ooh, let's go. We got uh, possibly a dime carp on here. I don't think that's too big of a stretch to predict that. Oh no, you got. I would. I don't. Be I, very shocked if it wasn't a dime. Because I've caught fifty-one pounders that didn't even come close to doing this kind of a fight. You're doing the same fight that that sixty-seven pounder did for me. My dime. Yeah, that was. Do you remember how many minutes it took? You? Uh, it wasn't crazy long. It probably ten, maybe. Look, look at how just how. Oh god. <laughs> He'll go from like yeah. six o'clock to ten o'clock in a split second. Yeah, and you're yeah, it's just holding you at just over two hundred. Whatever you get back goes right back out. <laughs> That's what I was saying when I was doing. It. I was like, man. I was like, I just reeled all that in. But I think he's starting to wear. I say it looks like the runs are getting a little less, so you might be over the hump. They they do have like second wind or last stand or whatever, so just be careful as you get it closer. Don't tell me that. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's good to know you don't want to be pumping yeah, full I'm, pump and have them. Well, I'm not even full pumping right now. I'm just doing. No, like I know. Yeah, he thought pumps. he thought me that too. Yeah, I was watching Darth do the challenges, and I so I noticed the, just the little pumps were better. Mm-hmm. Well, especially for those line challenges. I guess we're getting ready for his second run. At least by the boat, they usually uh, get pretty angry, too. I'm not even going to try a long punt with this dude. 
There, the right there is always getting. <laughs> yeah. I, I'm too invested. I can't even cast my line. I don't want. My finger is oh. on the Z button right now. <laughs> yeah, just wait, right? Like. Uh. Oh, he's right under me. I see him. Here, I'll try to grab him for you. <laughs> right. Bonk just, him for me. Just, Bonk him. Just, just net him for him yeah. from my bow. That would be fun, being able to net each other's fish. I still think that would be a great mechanic. It would be. I think it would be a tough mechanic to oh, get. Oh, Cole just got a diamond camiso. He, he was slaying the goads out there, wasn't he? Yeah, now there's a, another diamond. It's the second diamond camiso I've seen today in my lobby. Yeah, that's why I can't go for him. <laughs> Not till tomorrow. Oh, he's 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 getting down there now. Oh no. Oh, he's such a whale. Oh, that's a big fish. He's such a whale. <laughs> I can see it from here. Oh my god, even from all the way where I am, that fish looks massive. Goodness, that's a huge fish. Now here's where he's oh. turning. Got him! Let's yeah! 69.24! Ooh! Wow! I'm the devil's Let's advocate. Go. Look there, I got a full 1% on the advocate. pure champion. <laughs> I've never <laughs> said I've never seen it say one percent on the pure champion like that. It's always just, you know, like point ten or something. Almost yeah, 70 right. pounds. Just off. Wow. Congratulations. Wow. 69.24. New best rank. Reckon? By, by my per personal best by 17.92 <laughs> pounds. Yeah, almost 18 pounds <laughs> improvement. And you had a gold. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's an 18 pound improvement from a gold. That's insane. Lift that tail up a little bit that for me. That is a monster. Easily the biggest I've seen, like, while I was fishing with someone. E wow. All right. Wednesday, we'll be targeting Miracart. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> As you saw, that was quite the fight. I mean, every it took everything. I was very worried. They took me out there to 240, 250 area. I was getting worried. I was asking. I was like, oh, how much lines this thing got? It was... Uh, it was quite a fight on the Devil's Advocate. So that's going to get a little easier once we turn level 90. As you can see, I'm level 88 and a half right now. Hard to do with the challenges being broken at the moment. Hard to do, but we're getting there. We're leveling some of our rods. As you can see here, guys, we are entering week eight of Tackle Tuesday. I'm in the lead, 70 total points over Johnny Crow 66. Scarecrow following hard. At 61, Bro Brawl with 58, Big Rig at 54, Tawny from DoorDash 51, Dre Talk, who foiled our win last week at 46, Official Doe and Flanky, Chip Ninja, Kensko, and CJO. So tonight, are we going to get another second place? Are we finally going to win one? You know, I'll be happy with the top four finish. You know, that might be enough to keep me up there in the mix. So Camizo Barbel are fun to fish for so anyway guys if you would do me a favor hit that like subscribe notify bell that way you're notified when we go live tonight and tackle tuesday hope to see everyone there and then catch us over on twitch at darth underscore slum for our other streams we'll catch you in the next video